Hi guys, we have seen the Paul Force Dagger recently and now another dagger that I really like. <laughs> that's a fucking that's one is for fighting, but but yeah, you will see, you will see. That's the new uh, AGF uh, dagger, which is super cool. Super cool actually. And um, and what? And what what can I say on that except that it's fucking super thick. That's crazy thick. So that stuff is for what? I think that that yeah. One guy said when I showed the I, I, I put the picture, he said this is to pierce armors. It probably is why right. this is fucking like if you like a, a, a knife, a knight, and you are living in Game of Thrones or whatever, uh, like Sir Sir Arrington, you can like, just kill people with that, and you can pierce an armor easily. I think or, or safety vest or whatever, life vest or whatever. I don't know what you can pierce, but. Uh, and that's super pointy. So let's look at that stuff in the time. You are very, very, this is A8 steel, first of all. So very strong and tough steel. It's not gonna fail. Uh, especially when you pierce, because when you pierce, you don't really care of the steel. You, you are not here to get sharp edge. You're just here to pierce. But but at least with that steel, you know that it's gonna last and the tip is gonna be strong. That's the most important. So you can pierce armor because A8 steel is super strong and an armor probably less strong than A8, so you're gonna pierce it. So you have a super nice Mikarta under, and they have done an insert in Mikarta uh, orange, which is super, super cool, no? This, I mean, it's a bit of work to do that that stuff. Uh, it, 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 this is adding in the price of the, of the knife because more steps you have to build a knife or to manufacture a knife, more expensive it is, of course. So you have to consider that every time they do something, for example, every time they do that blood grove, this is a new uh, equipment of people uh, check and control and step, and it costs money. They do it this way, you see? That small stuff here. They don't have to do it. They could have cut straight, less work, less cost. And, and so they are not trying to save cost on that knife. They are trying to do a beautiful one, and I think it's made. They, they, they made it. Look at the, the the school crusher on the bottom. It's super well made. You have a lot of different angles on that. So I really like it. Small lanyard all. Uh, thin handle, but of course it's thin because <laughs> the steel is super thick. And here, look at the tip, guys. That, that, honestly, that's a needle. And this is a very thick needle and the edge is amazingly made. This is super symmetrical. This is not easy to do a dagger properly. And that stuff is very made. And that's, that's okay. For men of the knife, we joke, we say that's a blood grove, but it's not really, this is just to play, but that's maybe designed to be a blood grove at the end, maybe uh, because of the knife. Let's look at the sheath now. So the sheath is super nice too. And they put a orange liner in the middle to match with the orange ear, which I think is super classy too. Uh, maybe you don't want to get too much visibility on that kind of fighting knife, but maybe this is good to get a piece of orange if you drop the knife. You know, that's something that's low profile, but still, if you drop it or you want to see it and find it quickly in a, like, let's say, dark environment or whatever, you will see a bit the orange and you can find it, but it's not attracting too much light and too much visibility too. So, really like it. Maybe you can use it for hunting, whatever. The retention is perfect, honestly. It's a heavy one, but the retention is perfect. Hop, super nice, super good click. Super nice. Look at what they have done. They have done the belt loop in laser, which is super well made and adjusted. It's thick laser, very thick laser with this nice up piece of laser. But look how thick it is. Nice pick of piece of laser to secure it. So you got that stuff, I mean, with a small hole here. It's super well made, honestly, that's super well made. I'm, I'm really happy with the quality. It was not expensive. Pay that stuff 75 bucks, imagine. Or 80, I don't remember, but it was cheap. I was like, wow, not so expensive for stuff like that. And uh, okay, it's not a big, big blade, but I mean, if I compare it to the, to the pole force, because I have another dagger here. Can see it's not so bad, no? Handle to handle, uh, honestly. If I have to fight and to be classy, I would probably get that one to say, "Hey, kill you." 
bad guy. But if I really want to get efficient, I probably get more damage with that stuff, and I probably it's not gonna break, and it's gonna pierce anything. Look at the difference in thickness of the post. I can put two knives like that, maybe three inside this one. So let's look at the spec, no, because the size of the blade, we, we don't care around the thickness, but let's look at the size of the blade first. 13 centimeters blade, okay, 13.5 to the handle, overall size 26.203. Uh, then we have the thickness, okay, here, here we go, here we go. 8 millimeters, guys, 8 millimeter thickness. Yeah. Yeah, 7.6 is almost 8. And you get that 8 millimeter thickness, seven, more than 7, almost to the top. So here, if you look at the stuff here, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm taking it here. I still have 7 millimeter thickness. And, and, and if I go to the tip here, still have 5 millimeter. Yeah. It's hard to take it. Yeah, more than 4 millimeter thickness. So that stuff is super, super, super strong, super pointy. Super good, and in the end, this is just super comfortable. Honestly, that fitting the hand so well, the, the 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 shape of the handle is super well made. I really like that stuff. Honestly, if you like, if you're into dagger, you should get that one definitely. The weight, no, three hundred thirty-five grams. It, it's big. I mean, it's heavy. So three hundred thirty-five grams and four hundred forty-five with the sheath. Yeah, uh, nice, nice one. Honestly. In terms of dagger, maybe not the most fancy, but but really good looking and really really strong. I like it. You will let me know if you like it too, guys. Thank you. Bye bye.